up guys, welcome back. This is The Social Cut, I'm Steve, thanks for watching. Well, as you already know, spring is here and summer's just around the corner. So what better way to start talking about what we're gonna start wearing for all our uh, evening events, daytime parties, pool parties, beach parties, barbecues. Um, so you probably know already, California casual. Uh, us Californians here have gotten a bad rap about what we wear during the summertime. We're pretty much notorious for wearing flip-flops, jeans, uh, khaki shorts, cargo shorts, uh, a regular tee, polo shirt, whatever you want to call it. Uh, guys get excited when they hear California casual because it pretty much for some reason guys think it gives them a pass to wear almost pajamas outdoors, uh, just kind of look sloppy, but guess what, not anymore. So uh, today's topic, the new way to dress California casual. So I want to show you guys how you can make any outfit that looks dressy, we can casual it up. And I'm really excited because uh, for this video, uh, my buddy's over at ties.com, hugged me up with this nice little snazzy tie here. And I'm going to show you guys how we can uh, get this get up I have here and uh, get you guys ready for any parties, outdoor events you guys have this spring and summer. So uh, let's get started. Alright guys, so let's first start off with the bow tie. So I got this bow tie here from ties.com and it's a real bow tie, it's not a pre-tied uh, bow tie. So you want to make sure you grab a real bow tie because um, it gives off an, an unevenness look which is great because it adds character to the look and uh, people know that it's an actual real bow tie. So make sure you stay away from those pre-tied bow ties because unless you want to look like you're going to prom, um, stay away from them. Uh, and if you still think that no one will notice the pre-tied bow tie, then just start watching now. But like I said, these ties are awesome because they give a preppy and nautical look and work great for uh, spring and summertime events, barbecues, uh, events on the beach, whatever you want to do. So make sure you guys grab one of these bow ties. Next, you want to pair your bow tie with a Oxford shirt. So this one I'm wearing here is a white Oxford shirt. Uh, it, it gives off a casual yet put together uh, look and works great with the bow tie. And uh, the best part about it is that uh, most of these Oxford shirts are wrinkle free and uh, it's made of breathable material so it makes sure uh, it keeps you cool during those warmer days. So the only thing you really have to worry about is not spilling your margarita or your Long Island iced tea on your shirt. Uh, hey, whatever you want to drink. I don't judge, up to you, man. Now let's move on to the pants. Like I mentioned earlier, guys would get excited when they hear California casual because, again, it gave him for some reason an excuse to wear cargo shorts, khakis, jeans, pretty much any comfortable piece of clothing they have and wear it outdoors. But guess what? Not anymore. So, like I mentioned, it's the new California casual. So it's time to start dressing up, but casually up our attire. So what I did here is I'm wearing some window paint pants. Let me stand up for you guys to check them out. So hopefully you guys like these pants. And it, it's a perfect time, spring and summertime, to, to be bold and have some fun with our, with our pants. And uh, pair them up with, with the bow tie, with the nice vest, and just have some fun with it. It's a great time to, to be comfortable in these type of pants. Uh, and for me, I've always found them uh, comfortable. Our dress pants are usually made of thinner material compared to our jeans or, or khakis. So why not wear them when we want to be casual uh, outdoors and again, perfect for spring and summer uh, time fun. So what's the best way to make any outfit look casual? Just throw on a cap. Huh, you get it? Throw on a cap? Yeah, all right, anyways. Now, what's the best way to make any outfit look dressy? Just throw on the vest. See where I'm going with this? So basically what you want to do is combine casual pieces with dressier pieces for a new California casual. So let me throw on my cap here so you guys get an idea of what... Huh? Huh? What you guys think? You're gonna need a jacket for when your daytime shenanigans go into the evening hours. Pretty easy guys, just uh, grab a lightweight 
khaki jacket like the one I'm wearing here with a pop-up collar and you'll be good to go. And what's that you're saying? Yes, you don't need a jacket in the summer or spring in California. It doesn't matter because they look good in it anyways. Alright, flip-flops have been the epitome of California casual. I mean, guys wear flip-flops here, have worn them with just about any outfit you can think of. And guess what? Not anymore. I swear, that's the last one. But seriously, enough with the flip-flops. Yeah, we can throw them on here and there, but it's a new California casual. We need to step up our game, and we need to throw on a pair of, boom, some of these, some Sperry's. These are awesome with the outfit I'm wearing. Uh, these can take you from the beach straight to a backyard barbecue. So make sure you guys grab a pair of these Sperry's and uh, they'll complete your California casual look. So there you guys have it, the new California casual. Uh, hopefully you guys uh, got some tips you guys can use and uh, are ready for the new California casual. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys have any questions of, uh, about this video or need some more tips about men's fashion or men's grooming, shoot me an email. You can send your questions to steve at thesocialcut.com. And of course, you guys can check me out on social media, uh, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Snapchat, anything else you can think of. You guys can find me at The Social Cut. And of course, please rate my video. And by rate, I mean give me a thumbs up. And uh, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel for more of these videos. And that's it for today, guys. We'll see you soon.